We are Americans, and we are very diverse. We agree on many things, and we disagree just as often. But there is one thing that we have all come to believe, that our government is broken. Most of us link that failure to the influence of money in politics, and more than 90% of us, Republicans, Democrats, and independents alike, believe that influence should be reduced. But the problem is just about the same number of us believe that influence can't be reduced. We see our government work not for us, but for the campaign funders. Indeed, the largest empirical study of policy choices by our government ever in the history of political science confirms that they don't work for us, that they don't respond to the views of the average voter, that they respond instead to the elites. Now, most of us can't see what we could do to change this. We watch as our government veers into craziness, as the perpetual war of perpetual campaigns leads to an ever more polarized government. Each side works hard to get us to hate the other. Indeed, their whole way of raising money depends upon us hating each other. They care more about winning than about governing. So they win while we lose. On May 1st, May Day, we launched an experiment to see if we could do something about it. With a web page and a blog post and some tweets and emails among friends, we kicked off an experiment to see if we could kickstart a super PAC big enough to end all super PACs. A super PAC that over two election cycles, in 2014 and 2016, would win enough seats in Congress to pass fundamental reform. Reform that would radically change how campaigns were funded so that our representatives might once again work for us. The plan was to pilot the idea in 2014, running campaigns in five districts to learn what works, and then to return in 2016 with a much, much bigger and smarter campaign to win. Now, we estimated the cost of that 2014 pilot would be about $12 million. And someone said to me, why don't you kickstart it? Why don't you see if you could raise half that money in small dollar donations from Americans who want their democracy back? I thought it was a crazy idea, but on May 1st, we tried it. We set an initial goal of $1 million in 30 days. If we met that target, I promised to get it match, and then we would have an even crazier goal of $5 million in 30 days. And if we met that goal, I'd get that matched too. Now, no one thought it could be done. Even I was deeply unsure, but we tried it because we have to try something, because we have to find a way to get this democracy back. We tried it, but you did it. In less than two weeks and more than two weeks ahead of schedule, almost 13,000 individuals had contributed more than $1 million. The median contribution was just $50, and almost 3,500 gave $20 or less. We tried it, but you did it. And from the bottom of my heart, a heart that loves this country, I want to thank everyone who helped. You have proven something that will change everything. You have shown that Americans care about this issue. They care about their democracy. And they are willing to stand up, not as Democrats or as Republicans, but as citizens to claim their democracy back. But now we have a much, much greater challenge. Between now and July 4th, we have to do it again, but five times over. Over 30 days, we must raise $5 million. And if we meet that goal, I'll get that matched too. And then we'll have the money we need to make this pilot work. So we need your help. If you can pledge or pledge again, please do. If you can get others to pledge, please, please do. Indeed, if everyone who pledged the first time around got just five of their friends to pledge, we are certain we would make it. And then when 100,000 Americans stepped up to grab this democracy back, the politicians will finally notice. And something that I am now sure of, they might possibly just begin to grok that we are going to do this that we are going to get our republic back. So please join us. Join us and share us, and do whatever you can to bring more Americans in. As I promised before, I commit to you again, every dollar we raise through these Kickstart campaigns will fund campaigns. Every dollar you give will matter. 
So pledge whatever you can, share as much as you can, and help us to recruit the citizens we need to get our country back so that on July 4th, we can make our declaration for independence again, for a government independent of the special interests, for a government dependent on us, the people. Mayday, mayday, mayday. This democracy needs you. It is time for you to step up.